In a bid to tackle insecurity challenges by providing the security architecture, uh, Kaduna State Government has recruited 7,000 personnel into the State Vigilante Service to support other sister security agencies in addressing the menace of banditry, criminal activities in the state and the nation at large. The state governor, Ube Sani, gave the assurance at the flag of training ceremony of the canvas at the police college in Kaduna. These men and women will undergo intense, rigorous physical and civil training to enhance their expertise in working with other agencies. Governor Sani says the service is complementary with actionable intelligence and knowledge of local environment to deal with bandits in communities. Strengthening the manpower and overall operational capacity of targets has been working with security agencies to degrade criminal elements but we face the challenges of inadequate personnel to successfully wage the battle against bandits and other criminal elements. It is for this reason that our administration decided to recruit 7,000 personnel into the Kaduna Vigilance Services countries. The screening was very thorough. We have here energetic young men and women of transparent honesty who are committed to supporting our local communities. It will assist the security agencies with actionable intelligence. With its knowledge of the local environment, bandits will have no hiding place. Also, the commandant of the police college in Kaduna says their synergy with other security agencies will make bandits and criminals unsafe. In this giant slide we are taking, I think it's a laudable uh, effort in view of the numerous security challenges, not only in Kaduna State and across Nigeria, but the whole globe. So we are very happy with the efforts, the initiatives that we are initiated, and uh, we are here assuring you, sir, that this college will stand behind you in all your efforts to fight security, to train people and retrain security and civilization in Kaduna State. Assets that have been quartered. All the arrangements have been made, and we are assuring you, sir, that throughout the weeks we are going to spend here, we are going to do what we are expected to do, and we are going to get the result at the appropriate time. He charged the new recruits to show seriousness and commitment to their training. He also warned them to desist from violating the right of citizens while assuring government's support to discharge their duties effectively. I charge you to show seriousness and commitment. Listen to our to your instructors and be disciplined. I'm confident that you will all be found worthy of being enlisted in the Kaduna Vigilance Service. I must, however, warn that when you are eventually enlisted into the service and you start carrying out your duties, you must desist from violating the rights of the citizens. Cadres were set up to protect the people, not to violate their rights. We shall not instead to discipline any person that flouts the operational guidelines or code of conduct of the service and order heads of security agencies for their unwavering support to countries. The government insisted on prioritizing security, protection of lives and properties of its citizens by providing enabling environment for peace and tranquility in communities. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.